I start uh, with a presumption that people's bandwidth for dealing with impatience, for dealing with stress, for dealing with moments of high emotion are going to be necessarily limited and perhaps much more limited than they would be in a normal environment or normal circumstance. So <clears throat> the question is then against that mediator's mind or that assumption that I'm making coming into the mediation world, the virtual world, what do we find? And, you know, it's a combination of things. I think, as you would expect, we clearly find those people who reflect the world I've just described by less patience, uh, by more emotional outbursts, by things that don't appear commensurate with the moment that they're in, and I have to keep reminding myself they may be reflecting other stresses in their lives. 